Hi, welcome to Shift 4. I'm Colin. We're looking at the Venice today because all of Shift 4's Venices have now had the version 4 firmware upgrade done, which includes um, a lot of the new high frame rate options. Now, these are different depending on what codecs and resolutions you're using, so we're just going to do a quick rundown of what's available in one setting. So, first off, internally, XAVC 480 and 300. Pretty much no matter what resolution you're shooting on the sensor, it's 30 frames for XAVC 480 and 60 frames for XAVC 300 until you get to full frame, in which case they're all 30. So other than that, if you want to use the proper higher speed options, you're going to need the R7 recorder attached to the back to shoot XOCN RAW, uh, which comes in LT, ST and XT. Doesn't matter which one you use, the maximum frame rate is the same for all three RAW options. So starting at the bottom, we've got 3.8K, 16 by 9 can go up to 60 frames. 4K 17 by 9 can go up to 110 frames. Including that Super 35 area is 2.39 by 1 4K. That shoots 120 frames per second. Up from there, we've got 4x3, which is for two times animal fit lenses, can go up to 75 frames per second. 6x5, which is also for two times animal fix, goes up only to 30 frames per second. Then we get onto full frame. At the moment, they're all limited to 30 frames per second. That's 16 by 9, 6K, 17 by 9, 6K, and 2.39 by 1, 6K. However, if you shoot the full full frame, which is 6K, 3 by 2, you can actually shoot up to 60 frames doing that in RAW. Um, so if you do have a full frame production and you want to go up to 60 frames, what you should do is shoot 3 by 2 full frame and then letterbox it to whatever standard you're using. The reason for that is that um, there is a firmware update scheduled for January 2020, which is version 5, which is due to include the high speed options for full frame, um, which goes from around 90 to 75 frames per second, depending on the resolution. But that's due for January 2020. Uh, so we'll update you then when that happens. Thanks for watching.